Hi crafters, happy July. I wanted to hop on and touch base with you since it's been a while since I've had some live events and I'm just excited that uh, the new catalogs have arrived. I can't show you inside of them yet, but I do have them here at my house. So if you come to any events in July, uh, you can pick up your copy. So we have the mini catalog, which up here it says it starts in July, but there has actually been a delay. And so instead they're not gonna start until August 3rd. And this goes until the end of December. So this is the holiday catalog, which is pretty thick, lots of good stuff in here. And then celebration, for whatever reason, they've decided to have two this year. So the first one has already happened. And then the second one, goes from August 3rd to September 30th. So for two months, uh, anytime you place an order of $50 or more, you can choose an item out of this catalog. And because I'm a demonstrator, one of the best perks that I love about being a demonstrator is that you get to pre-order um, a month early, which means I could earn a lot of good new stuff early. So let's get showing you what I have. Now I do wanna say, that this is a bigger order than I normally place, uh, mainly because I needed to renew my paper pumpkin subscription. And so I always buy a year at a time. And so as a result, I got lots of free stuff this order. Okay, so first I'm gonna start with the embossing folders and this is called Merry Melody. And I am not much for any music. I can't play any instruments and I definitely can't sing very well, but I just love the idea of music paper and now we have a music embossing folder. So it'd be really cool to like emboss this on foil or maybe emboss it on white and then use like a black to um, add the um, color on the part that pops up. So this is called Merry Melody. Okay, the next one, and that was a 3D folder. This one is also a 3D folder. This one is called Timber. I am, love wood grain anything. So I love wood paper. And this is just another, like a wood grain folder. It's called Timber. Okay. There's another one called Type Worn, Time Worn Type. Also a 3D folder. I think we're moving to primarily all 3D folders at this point. These are six by six, so the larger size, and it's got some kind of uh, letters on here, but it's also just got some like, you know, distressed look or whatnot. So that will be a good one. Okay, the there's one I didn't get, so I don't have that one to show you, but this one is interesting. This is the first time I think ever, because I had to create a new category in my Airtable database, um, but this one, is an embossing folder that comes with dies. And if you get the bundle, you get the stamp set. So this is called Merriest Frames Hybrid Embossing Folder. And sadly, I don't even remember which stamp set it goes with right now, but I'll take these out. So this is like a frame with some holly coming around. And then it goes with this die set oh wow look at that so two sheets of dies here so this one here and I put it move all this stuff over onto magnet so I'm breaking it up for quite haphazardly here but it looks like there's some kind of die that would um, go with the embossing folder and then also the stamp set so um, options for lots of different flowers and frames on this one Wish I could remember off the top of my head which stamp set it goes with. So if anyone's watching, I see a couple ladies. Hi, Jennifer and Linda, who are on our team. So they probably might have even already ordered this. Um, so later on, I guess I'll figure out which one that goes with. All right, let's move over to more Christmas stuff. So I think this is, nope, this is a stamp set Christmas to remember. And it's got a lot of great, I love the font. It's mixed font, but it's also, um, I, I just like how the tall skinny letters. So uh, friends like you make this season special. 
Okay, and that's with a bundle, and I can't remember which one. I'll figure it out once I sit down to actually start playing. All right, I think this is another bundle called Marius Moments. Uh, maybe that was the one that goes with it. It's got some flowers and holly. Okay, this one is a photopolymer stamp set. And then I think this is the die set that goes with it, I think. It's called Seasonal Labels. Oh, wow, another two-setter. I might be wrong, but they coordinate somehow. So this um, is a big label, and then there are lots of other labels here that you can use on other projects as well. These little doodads would cut out slits in this long label. Looks like these will too. So if you want to like string ribbon through that, you can. Okay. All right. Let's look at another one. I, I think I was in a mood for um, the same kind of look, but this one's called Christmas Season and it's got some pine cones. So this is called a two-step stamp. So you can layer these on top of each other to give the pine cone dimension and then the leaves and then some berries over here. And this one goes with these dies. And there are just lots of dies in these sets. Um, look at that. So this is, I, I just love the samples that I can see in the catalog, which you can't see yet until you get your hands on it. But this is a double layer background of holly. So these like layer on top of each other. So it looks really, um, this one's got some less tricking, more treating and which way to the candy. And this stamp set's okay. I like the baddie for you with the bat image down here. But I primarily got it because of the dies that go with it. It has a spider web. And I have occasionally wanted a die uh, spider web for some of my projects. It's also got a little fence, a little tiny tree, uh, these some good options for labels, a circle that punches out the moon. But you can use that circle for lots of other things. So um, I'll probably be using this for a swap probably coming up. All right, and then for those of you that like punches, I had I couldn't resist the penguin place. This is a bundle um, with a punch option. And I started, I just couldn't wait to punch one out. So you can see here, it punch, you punch out the black here and you punch out white here and you glue that there. And then this piece here punches out feet so you can get two feet like here. And then once you come over to the stamp set, uh, you can get the eyes down here to punch out or to stamp eyes and then stamp. I think there are two different nose options. This nose goes here and this nose goes there. Um, but this one can be used for Christmas, but it also um, has some happy birthday and balloons. So it's also versatile or someone who has a winter birthday. So I plan to get right uh, using that one right away. All right, so I think I already showed, yeah, I already showed you that one. Okay, so now let's move on to um, embellishments. So ribbons, I love all the new ribbons. This one is called Glittered Organdy, and it's a white that has some like sequin-ish looking that's more a little bit more pink color. Um, so it's sheer, but it's got some like glitter in there. If you can see that, really pretty. Okay, then this one is just so festive. It's it's red, so it's probably a cherry cobbler, but it's got a lot of gold trim on the side, but also trim, um, or you know, it's just sort of infused in there. So really shimmery, and it's the same on both sides. And that one is called cherry cobbler and gold uh, metallic ribbon and then this one is a black and white what's that called gingham ribbon and this one actually goes with the um halloween suite so i already showed you some halloween dies and stamps but i'm here i'm going to show you this ribbon and then so i got the paper as well be pain to get off sometimes okay so that's a little bit thinner than I thought so um, a little bit different than what we've had before a little bit easier to tie too all right that's all the ribbon I got didn't get many embellishments so I'll have to get those in my next order but this is gold holly leaves 
and this goes with one of the suites of um, so it's looks like it's the same on both sides no actually you can see the lines on this side but not on that side they're very thin actually you would probably want to use like glue dots to put those down but I'll just add some interest to some of the paper that I'll show you here in a minute okay these snowflakes are fun they're called wonderful snowflakes and they come in a sheet of there are six on a sheet and I'm not sure how many sheets there are the package probably tells you there are 24 but it's like a shimmery look at that you can see it I think in the camera and then on this side it's solid white so you could use it whichever way that you want so they're all snowflakes are the same size so it's a bigger snowflake um, a little bit bigger than the size of an embellishment jar okay all right let's take a look at paper because we all love paper so this is the Halloween it's called cute Halloween it's six by six and I think it's the only six by six pack in this holiday catalog so it's got um, some ghosts on one side it says boo on the other okay then this sheet is cats and pumpkins and black and white striped on that side we've got some polka dots and some fun colors and then uh, candy on black and white which would be fun to color the candy different colors if you wanted some bats on one side and black solid with some little interest on there orange and black striped with black and white polka dots some happy looking skeletons <laughs> with some gray and white stripes and then some um, haunted houses in green and skulls and um, bats over there and you can tell I'm not in the Halloween mode yet I'm like what are these things called again <laughs> okay some more stripes that this could definitely doesn't even look Halloween you could use it for something else and then black and white squiggles over there so this is the Halloween set and I do plan to do another DSP share if anybody's interested in that details will come out on August 3rd this is a pack of paper called velvet sheets snowy white velvet sheets and there's comes with uh, two pieces of cardboard there and then um, it's just velvet so you can make your own snowflakes with that it feels really nice okay I am so excited about this new edition this is cork paper and can't remember how much it costs I'm pretty sure there are two pages in here yep um, so it's actually a lot thinner than you would think because it's cork it looks like it's got some kind of shimmer in there too when you twist it you can see a shimmer um, but it actually does feel like cork so I'm gonna use this sparingly but it is so it is so pretty I just love cork I don't know why what's there to love about cork I don't know <laughs> okay this paper is so pretty it's called painted Christmas it's got calypso coral cherry cobbler um, and real red in there so you've got I like it when they do both cherry cobbler and real red and then for the greens it's um, soft sea foam soft succulent evening evergreen and garden green so lots of shades of green it just makes it so easy to coordinate that way um, I won't show you every piece but you get the idea it's a lot of berries and pine cones so it went with that pine cone set right and then if you flip it over it's different on the back so a lot more brighter um, patterns um, some that you can even use for non Christmas projects as well okay now this I did not get the whole suite on this because I just ran out of money I guess uh, <laughs> But this paper, I just had to get it. It was so beautiful. It's specialty paper. And I think it's what goes with this. I think it was in the suite with this ribbon, I think. Um, but specialty basically means it has a shimmer on it. So there are silver snowflakes. And then the trees look like they shimmer too with their... So this would be a whole background sheet but it is double-sided so it's like a gray checkers on that side Ooh, this is fun so this paper can be cut down into four quadrants and it's the same in each of the four quadrants 
so you can create a snowy scene. Then we've got gray trees on this side. Okay, I just have to show you every paper in this pack because it is so beautiful and you can never tell in the catalog how beautiful these are. So again, you, you may or may not be able to see a shimmery snowflake here and then um, gray gingham on the back. This is a tree bark pattern and this is super shimmery with some trees here. And then this is just like a design with silver in it, but definitely doesn't have to be used for Christmas. So there's a stamp set and dies that look like these, um, which I did not get, but that's what goes with this bundle. And then this sheet here is interesting too, because it's solid white down here. I guess that would be the snow. So if you cut this in half, you could also make four quadrants with that and then another gray pattern over here. So that paper is so beautiful. All right, now let's talk celebration. So for every $50 you spend, you get to pick something for free. So I got lots of free things on this order. Um, actually, I got everything except one thing. So you can probably guess how much I spent. But um, this one doesn't thrill me because I'm not one to be like jumping with shapes and coming up with all these creative patterns and the backgrounds or whatnot. But everybody loves a good splatter stamp. So there's that. There are also lines. So you, I could even see people making like um, American flag card using that. Uh, this could be a sun or a sun here. So different textures and frames on that one. That's free with the $50 order. Okay, sheep is the, they always have one animal stamp set during celebration. So this year it is sheep. And um, there are three different sheep um, and it can be a birthday stamp if you want. And the fun part about this one is it actually has dies. So you can get the dies free with a $50 order and you can get the stamp set free with a $50 order. So you can get it all free with a $100 order. But it's got a nice fence. I always love fences. It's got a sun, it's got two clouds, a balloon, a flag. So lots of options that you can use, not just for sheep, but also on other cards as well. Okay, this is a nice versatile set. Feels like home. There's a thank you, a friendship, here for you and a missing you. Um, but that one looks like a fun option to color, a lot of detail, um, fine lines, uh, maybe maybe even leave it black and white, but it's um, called Feels Like Home. So that's free with 50. And then the fun part about having celebration around Christmas time or the leading up to the holidays is some of our options now are, are free um, holiday options. So this is a pack of paper that's free with a $50 order. And it actually coordinates with some products in the holiday catalog, which I have not bought. So there is a reindeer or deer uh, punch in the catalog in the holiday catalog that will punch that guy out so that would make it very easy but this pack is a little bit more um, like blacks whites reds what's the, the name of that look sort of like farmhouse Christmas right so birch trees over here uh, looks like a sort of candy cane pa pattern we've got some snowflakes with some plaid oh this one's really cute uh, trees, green polka dots, some green snowflakes, green leaf pattern, some more reindeer jumping on crumb cake or maybe Sahara sand, and some gingham. So when celebration starts in August, I make sure to always get all the paper that you want first because that those will go before the stamps. So all of these supplies will be, um, all these freebies will be while supplies last. And the paper always goes out, sells out first before the stamp sets do. So keep that in mind as you plan out your orders for August and September. Okay, this is a free option that's a black and white option. It's all paper, 12 by 12. It's got some watercolor look to that. Um, we've got some flowers, some polka dots. These can also be fun to color. So this looks like other paper that we have, um, the hand penned, but a smaller version. But it definitely looks watercolored, like someone painted that side. This side is 
not. Okay, and then this one I didn't show you either. So combination of black and white and flowers, but also could potentially be used for like a Christmas option. Okay, I am so excited about this. I, I don't know why. I, I mean, I love glitter, but this is just a different kind. It's called Be Dazzling. It's six by six and you get eight sheets of it. And they said, be careful using it on your regular trimmer, which I generally don't use to cut anything like this. Um, I use more of like the guillotine cutter, but this is, I can't tell. It's in some lights it looks silver and some lights it looks champagne, but it is so pretty. It's like a bigger uh, sequin look. So you get lots of sheets on that. So that will make some festive projects. And then last one is, no, it's not the last one. I know there's another one in here somewhere. Uh, this one coordinates with the penguin suite and punch that you can get in the holiday catalog. But if you want the paper, that's a free option. So I love how they do that. Um, okay, so this has a fox and a polar bear in addition to the penguin. On this side, you've got some, that looks like, what color is that? just jade is that a current color <laughs> can't remember okay another penguin i'm guessing our punch punches that one out so snowmen incorporated in here this is like a i think that's a misty moonlight blue okay this one adds some of the pur purple look to it all same thing with this one purple snowflakes on this side and more penguins and polar bears and snowmen and another polka dot so a little bit more pastel -y look on this one all right I got one more yes here it is another um, free option this one is free with a hundred dollar order and it's called summer shadows dies and I haven't quite figured this out like does this I don't think it goes with a stamp set does it go with this paper or anything I haven't quite figured it out um maybe someone on here knows that yep I think that's how it's meant to work I think don't hold me to it <laughs> um but anyhow there are some pretty flower dyes um, and then there's one other free option, free with a hundred dollar order, which I don't have yet. So that will be coming soon. So in any case, thanks for watching. I'm so excited. I've actually taken off like a month. So my in-laws are in town right now and the team gets there. Invited to come. It's been moved to MCL in Carmel instead of Castleton. That's next Tuesday. And just lots of fun things uh, ramping back up again. So I hope to see you soon. Um, make sure you get a copy of your catalog. If you don't have one already and you don't have a demonstrator, make sure you contact me. And I uh, hope you get to crafting.